Hi you guys, it's Corinne. Today I have some tips for you for Chorus from Judas Maccabeus from Suzuki Book 2. The first part I like to pull out is right before we go to that D sharp. So I start from the C natural to on that rest, keep the second finger down, reach the high three out, let go of two, and then place four. Otherwise, we're guessing a little bit. And sometimes that three doesn't quite make it underneath the four. So, set. So you're, this is while you're circling. Once you set the three, you can let go. That way three can get nicely under, right next to the fourth finger until you get used to playing D sharps. Because if you remember from book one, you only had that in minuet two. So that high third finger is still kind of new. Okay, then we'll go from the beginning. So we're gonna start at the frog, check in with your bow hand, make sure this is round, relaxed hand, shoulder is down, ready, and. Pop the three. circle and you're going to set back at the frog. Now with chorus, I love this one and I love how Dr. Suzuki placed it at the beginning of book two. We have lots of opportunities to work on tone, but also bow division. So when you have the four eighth notes that are slurred, try to divide your bow equally into four parts. Okay, so we're going to try that again from the beginning. One and two. Pop. Now divide evenly. Halfway. Two. Circle. You're going to set back at the frog. Check in with your bow hand. Make sure you're not like this. And half, half. Listen for this ringing G. And then leave your second finger just to place the three, one and two, over. Now what I see there a lot, that, we're pulling a little too fast, so. One, two, three. Use about three quarters of your bow, one, two. Remember, your hand is going to take the bow to the D. One, two, three, over, two, three, and you're already there. Frog, check in with your bow hand, even on the four notes slurred. Gentle. Now you're going to think fast bows. You're going to set the high three, four, go back to the frog. So I do not do an extra fourth finger there. It's okay if you want to. I prefer the open E. And you're also going to the E string. Circle and set at the frog. Make sure everything is relaxed. One, two, three. Pop the three. Same as the beginning. Pull evenly. One, two. Circle and set. Check. Listen for the ringing G. So 
Chorus is a beautiful piece. It gives us, once again, lots of opportunity to practice bow speed and bow division. So hopefully you found something helpful for Chorus from Judas Maccabeus. Thanks for watching. If you guys have questions, comment below and feel free to subscribe to my channel.